The number two. Right? The number two, yes. <laughs> We're going to Vespin. Dia de Dos. To rent scooters, hopefully. I don't know. I know. We'll we have a reservation for scooters. We'll see if they accept our American licenses as non international. Really? Tommy has an international one, I don't, so. Yeah, and even if. We both have our passports this time, so. And we're not sure if, you know, it's safe for us to drive them. They think maybe we shouldn't with a uh, lack of experience, but we'll see. The interwebs has lots of things they say. We'll find out. It's really close. We're going to walk there, and then we're going to go somewhere. Our um, Verbo host recommended us to eat. Yeah. Um, we got a bit of a change of plans today because originally the game, the, the Barcelona football game we were going to see was at 11.30 when we bought the tickets and planned. It's at 6.30 now. now. it's at 6.30. And our Sagrada Familia tour is at 4.30. It's probably at least an hour. A sudden excess of time means we get to go on an adventure. So yeah, we're going to have lunch and hopefully we can have the scooters to get down to the Barcelona game and just return them tomorrow morning. So, we'll see. Ready. Let's go. So guys, here you have three keys. The little black, open the box. Okay. First time, document of the scooter in case the police pull you over. Okay. Here you have all the papers that you need. With the big one, you turn on the scooter, but you open also the seat where you have place for the other helmet. Ah, cool. Gasoline, 95 green. When you finish your experience tomorrow morning, just in the corner you have a petrol station. Okay. Now it's full, and you must bring back full. 95 okay. green. Okay. Day two. Day two. So we just drove. Well, I just drove us and the best thing there. Semi terrifying. Uh, there's not that bad of traffic right now, so as long as I just don't pull out in front of anybody, I don't see it should be fine. Um, but now, now we're on our way to eat lunch at a place recommended by our Verbo host. So yeah, Canpuyentes. Let's see how it goes. Taste it. How spicy. Not spicy. Or not good. Not spicy. <laughs> it's so good. Yeah. Yes. Can we bring cakes to school or not? That is good. Mmm. This has got jalapenos in it. So if you can handle jalapenos. It's fine. It's not gonna focus that close, I bet. But it did. Okie dokie. Back at the apartment right now. We, uh, we drove the scooter a bit. Rode it, I guess you'd say. So good. We found this little square. We walked around a bit and got an empanada. Spicy meat that wasn't spicy at all, but it was still really good. And then they also, we found out they have a churro rio. A Stanford churros that I really want to go to, but we're gonna eat lunch now at where? It's like Biso Restaurante, Bisco, Bico. Oh, we're going there. Yeah, we're gonna go there, Bisco. and uh, we'll come back here for a little bit. So we'll see how it goes. Or Bico, that's what it's called. Bico's, Bico's yeah. restaurant. We're going to. Yes. Where are we? Uh, we're in 
and Nico. I think. Just yes, saw it. Some other hoity toity place needed reservations, so we didn't go there. It doesn't look too bad though. But uh, I think we're, we're ending up somewhere pretty good. We have uh, got a couple tacos to start with. This is the patatas bravas and then pan con tomate. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Tasty. Tastes like what it says it is. Yeah, probably one of those. And then we have the 12 apostles. That would be the 12 bell towers. In groups of four. Okay. Four, four, and four. Um, another important thing for you to notice is that when we look at the church from here, what we see is one side of the church. It's going to be the second tallest tower in this church. Remember, that's the one with the star. Now, this, the method they use here is called pre-stressed stone. So they build this with prefabricated panels made of stone. They are rectangular, up to five meters, that's like 15 feet high. They're done off-site, brought here in the morning, and then they are, you know, lifted up and put them where, where they belong. These are like pieces of a mechano, of a, of a Lego. It speeds up the process. And they are pre-stressed, so they have steel cables inside. our La Sagrada Familia tour and it was so beautiful and incredible except for the people talking behind me sitting in the pews don't sit in the pews 
if you're going to talk. Also, shitty little kids who aren't well behaved and their mother who just sits yeah, on her iPhone the whole time. and Touching everything, but we getting went in the, way. The, the perfect time when the sun was coming through. Yeah. The stained glass windows. And um, he left a lot of models, we found out to help all the future architects that are helping. Yeah. And so yeah, it was good, a little museum in the bottom. We had to see his crypt because he was hit by a tram. It'll and, be uh, finished in 2026, but now we have to go to the FC Barcelona game. Yep, yeah. so we're gonna get hop on the scooter and hope not to die on the way there, so. Yep, yeah, that's where we're going now. Right. So we're here, Camp New. I don't know if that's how you say it, but we're gonna go see a Barcelona game here. I don't know who they're playing. But it uh, should be fun. I think we're going to sit like way, way up top there. Up there. Um, so we just we just rode here on the scooter. So we'll see As how... You can how see, there's no shortage of scooters. But I don't know, just kind of saw this and we're like, oh, well, looks good enough. So that's where we're staying. We're going to park here. So yeah, we'll, uh, hopefully we don't have it towed by the time we get back. So yeah. Do you want to stop here? <laughs> Whatever you want. Huh? Whatever you want. Ooh. City that we're visiting in, in us, FC yes. Barcelona wins. <laughs> well, they, were we? They we're, played high bar. Yeah, high bar. We we wooed when they scored goals. So we did the way when they wooed. Yeah, yeah, that was us. That was us. We also said the very top, 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 top row. Basically, high as you could get. It's a bit windy and cold at one point, but I can't feel my hands. <laughs> and we got a we got a hot dog uh, with some like crispies on it. Um, and a water bottle. It costs like six sixty. So didn't honestly, didn't make any friends, but didn't make any enemies. No, exactly. A so. very nice couple took our photo in front of the stadium. Mm -hmm. too. We got kicked out a bit early by one of the security guys because I think he just wants to go home. But yeah, kicked out because he wanted to take photos. Yeah, we were gonna do this in the stadium, but instead it's in the background. So but definitely worth going. Yeah. Bye, Cam. It was fun. So, yeah, good. so today we're at Taco Bell yeah. for Tommy's Choice and we're trying out some items not available in the U.S. There's some like GFB burrito or something. We got chicken nachos and then we got some like basically it's like a dessert quesadilla. Um, the french fries, so here what's different is instead of just getting like a taco as a side you get to choose between french fries, nachos, and like a salad. So 
I think these nachos are just the nacho fries, these fries. I think they're just like the fries that they do like limited runs of at home. Like they have a like little table come, oh, nacho fries make a big deal. We have them, they have them all the time as their yeah, meal size. It's a limited time at home, but. Mm -hmm. They're the nacho fries? Yep, it's the same seasoning. Um, let me try this. This is a barbecue sauce. I've never had Taco Bell barbecue sauce before, but. Do we even have, we don't have barbecue sauce at all, right? Not that I know of. They might though. Is it just like a chicken nugget or is there cheese? It's just like a flat chicken, triangle it's chicken a nugget. It's chicken nugget. It's, it's thin. Um, they don't give you that much cheese. They don't know how us Americans live. <laughs> but yeah, pretty standard. Standard chicken nugget? Pretty much. And then the burrito. So you're able to choose your meat in the burrito and he chose carnitas, which we definitely don't have at home. Mm hmm Not appealing looking. Definitely not what the picture looks like. But it is good. Does it taste like what it is? Yes, you can taste the black beans. Which you can only get in like the health options back home, I think. So, yeah, that's good. Successful would, new would recommend. discoveries. I and would say. the most upsetting thing of all, they have Coke products instead of Pepsi, aka Dive Mountain Dew. It's really interesting because they kind of have like the Coke freestyle version, but a, well, a small version, yeah. so there's only ever six sodas available. I mean, the KFC across the street has Pepsi. Oh, why did they send you Pepsi here? <laughs> anyway, it's all good. So, we'll turn it. it. Is it worth it coming to investigate? Yeah. I think it's like 15, 14 and a half bucks for all this. We'll see what my bank converts it though. The mojito slushy here. Um, it's not a very pleasant color. Yeah, it looks, it like, looks like a booger. Like, yeah, I was gonna say, <laughs> like a snot slushy. <laughs> so we don't, we definitely don't have this at home. Nope. So it's not clear whether or not it's actually alcohol. What would you say? Mojito flavor. I think it's like edging more on a margarita. It's not as minty mm -hmm. as a mojito would be. They have four kinds of beer here, beer here, but. I feel like they would have maybe carded us if we... Oh, what's the drinking age here? Is it 18? Yeah, it's probably 18. Probably. So I guess we'll find out if this is a boozy slushy or not. Talk to... Yeah, we'll, fi we'll find, we'll find out. out in 10 minutes. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Two, stay tuned. The last item we got some like Choco Mash something or other? I don't know. It's like Choco big, Marsh. Choco Marsh. You can take the first bite. Okay. Um, from the cross section in the photo, it looks like uh, basically it's filled with s'more stuff. Yeah. That's why I, I thought, got it. oh wow, dollar, I mean, dollar, year old 25. I thought it, I w also, I was deceived and I thought it was gonna be like this big. Yeah. <laughs> Not me. Too. Oh, look. Okay. Wanna split it? Right, like that. Mm. Oh, like this. Or do you wanna just bite into it? Hmm. What's pink in there? Why is it pink? I don't know. What is it? Well, the marshmallow is right there, so. It tastes like what it is. Okay. <laughs> well, well I don't know what that is, so. Hmm. I'm trying to see if it's strawberry. This is like strawberry. Something like what is it? What is it? I can't tell. Where did we just come from? We just came from a grocery store and we got some water. They only have these like giant one and a half liter waters here. It's crazy. I love it. And then uh, we're going to be driving for a few hours tomorrow. So we don't know if we're going to be able to stop. So we got some snacks that we will review later in depth. But the highlight of this, the highlight of this trip is they sell, some Regina's. they sell Filipinos. What are they doing? Mm. <sighs> <laughs> 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 
Day number two over. What a long day. Dude, it was so long. We're running out of steam. Yeah. It was a great second day. So long. Um, ready to shower and go to bed and start tomorrow, though. Sleep. 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 Goodbye. <laughs> <laughs> End of day two. Yeah. And. Bean. Bean. Terminaste. Terminar. Good. And scene.